Alrighty, guys. Have you ever wondered what would happen if you bought an eBay account that's advertised as 100 champions and 100 skins? Today, I've bought a bronze one account with 117 champions and 74 skins. I've also bought another bronze one account with 125 champs and 91 skins. I'm also going to see if I have access to the account seven days later to see if it's a scam or not, which I honestly think it is. There's no way it's this cheap and you get all these champions and skins, right? Well, weirdly enough, in the product section, it says the account login details, including the usernames and pass. What? Well, you already know it's sketchy because it has a typo or something. And it says here the email and password of the account cannot be changed. Email is lost. I tried to contact Riot, but I don't remember all info to the account. All account is inactive for at last one plus year so you already know this kind of seems like a scam right but as you guys know <clears throat> you know i'm challenger i have no life and i'm asian so i'm probably gonna buy this ebay account and get scammed oh also did you guys know that only 66 percent of people watching this video are actually subscribed so uh if you guys want you can subscribe if not that's okay too but that being said let's jump right in yeah i bought this account but like I bought these accounts and they have like 74 skins and 117 champions. So I want to see what kind of champions are on it are on it for 24 bucks. Wait, what the hell? Help me top. Help me top and we win. Not really. Easy trash. Picks cheese. FF15. Yo, yo. Thing, but you aren't gonna win. Yeah, do you know win? This solution doesn't use all. So bad. Bronze Yasuo, so were you. Yeah, but you went and you chose. Choose FI. Y'all get a free win anyhow. It's 1v5. Please FF. We don't FF. Dragon is worth nothing. You can't even. Oh, Lucian, wish they would FF. Your bronze mongolized. Not really. Y'all suck. So quick. I'm the only one doing anything. I am. They're all fed. Always bought. Always bought. Y'all took four people just to trade fair. I don't know what's going on right now because games like this, I didn't play much as So I can't carry 1v5. Fun when your team won FF. I basically am. I was in your jungle AFK. You guys came for no reason. Whole team gap. Oh my god. This guy types so much. Level 13 count tries to defend that. What the hell? When was the last thing? When was it last played? Oh, this is played two months ago. Jesus Christ. Bought this for $24 USD. But I have to see definitely what the hell is on this account. So the champions he doesn't own is like Zyra, Zoe, Yumi, Yon, Viego, Thresh, Tom, Ken, Silas. Uh, a lot of the newer champions, obviously. Um, yeah. But he does have a vast amount of champions. So you're already getting your bang for the buck for this one. How much are these champions worth? And then you get Blue Essence. <laughs> Honestly, like this would probably cost 100 to 200 bucks around there. Maybe more, maybe less. I'm not too sure. It's a lot of champions. Now, yes, this is where we yes, get into yes, it. Yes. This is probably a 520 RP skin. So it costs five bucks. These are worth like five bucks, right? Um, five bucks. Frozen Shen, five bucks. Queen Ash. I think this is five bucks, right? Ten bucks. Oh man, this has to be five bucks. Legacy, or yeah, five bucks. Five bucks, um, I'd say five bucks. Five bucks, five bucks. Damn, these skins suck. Five bucks, five bucks, five bucks. <laughs> Most of these skins are basically five bucks at this point, right? Five bucks, five bucks, five bucks, five bucks, five bucks, five bucks. Ugh, five bucks, five bucks. These are so bad skins. And you got surprise party fiddlesticks, which is worth, he's only worth 10 bucks. There's no way, is it? Why is he red then? Oh my God, five dollars, five dollars. What's this? Nottingham Ezreal. Wow, this is a skin I've never seen before. Probably noticed. Five bucks, five bucks, five bucks, five bucks, five bucks, five bucks. I'm pretty sure most of these are five bucks. Sorry, I don't really know them. Five bucks, five bucks. But I just know like the way they look is really bad. This has to be five bucks. I think this is ten dollars. We're getting a lot of. We're getting better now, but this feels really bad. Okay, I'm obviously getting probably most of these wrong. So, you know, like this is probably worth 10 bucks. Wait, tech, this can is worth 975? You know, honestly, at this point, oh, he's got pulls to our Ezreal. There's a lot of, wait, this, this account is very, very high price for $25. First cat, Vayne, Assassin Master, you chat, like Shadow Prince, Hard Gun Graves, the Billy. Oh, a Moo Moo, <laughs> Emu Moo, Glacial Olaf, Viridian Kale. Damn, Thunderlord Valibear. Or Darius, Dryad, Firefang, Warwick. If he had Black Alistair, holy crap, this would be worth too much. Pulse Fire, Ezreal, Salem, Shaco, and then oh, he has all the traditional skins. Wait, these are so rare because you need to own the champion before the rework, which is really cool. He's got Higher Gun, Lucian, Gangplank. Oh, he's got Spooky Nocturne. 
a haunting knocker. That one, that one's a cool skin. I remember this one. Workshop Nunu, Arctic Ops Varus. That's really cool. Riot Kale. He's got l definitely a lot of uh, warrior skins, and he finally has Death Sworn Victor. And then he's basically quit for three years and came back and for some reason bought Noxus Hunter Anivia. This account, because I feel like it has Pulsefire Ezreal, is super high value, right? Like, how much does Ezreal cost? Yeah, it's literally still 3,250 RP. That is worth 30 bucks already. Hmm. For the emotes, he doesn't have any emotes. So yeah, that's obviously like a old account. Um, wait, he has Yon. That's new. But you have to be a split. Oh, 2020 he played. I guess I didn't know that. Let's go to icons. Let's see what rare icons he has. Similar, like very unrare. What's this? Shrima. Oh yeah, this is you can only get during an event in 2014. That's really nice. Rune reward epic mystery icon. I have no idea what this says. Also for Ezreal for buying it. Some split icons and that's it. No wards. Chromas is zero chromas. So honestly though, if you just like, dude, if you're just counting the skins and champions, you know, buying this for 25 bucks is really good for sure. Especially if it has pulse for Ezreal. So obviously this, this account has a lot of invested into it. Hold on. Let me see how, how much this person spent. How much money have I spent in League of Legends? Are you trying to find out how much you Well, here's how much you spent in League. Okay, let's find out. This is the calculator. Oh, wow. Wait, this account is worth... So, on eBay, I bought it for 25 bucks. The person who basically owned it before had spent $410 on it, and then on eBay, it's just like for 25 bucks. That's pretty insane. And obviously, you know, there are skin shards and all of that stuff, so there have been other stuff so like... Yeah, I'd say this is worth about... Dude, I'd say this this uh, account is like playtime worth. 74 skins. Let's just honestly say they're all worth 10 bucks. He has 117 champions. Honestly, how much is 117 champions worth? Let's say you bought them all. 300 bucks. Like, I feel like this account is worth somewhere around like $1,000, to be honest. If you include playtime. So newer players are just... Yeah, but new... But the, the fun part is obviously owning your own account. Yeah. This is pretty interesting. Sick. War door get gank. This cat's supposed to have 125 champs and 91 skins. Last played. Oh, this was a month and 21 days ago. I see. Okay, so this account basically doesn't own all of these champions, but that's only missing like 29 champions. And I think there's like 150 champions right now in League of Legends. So this account is already like right, 36 bucks. Now, of course, we got to see what skins are on this account. Let's check it out. Whoa! Okay, so this account looks kind of stacked. I'm not going to lie. The last one had only like three reds and one legendary or sorry, one ultimate. It was whatever, but this one... I can definitely see having a lot more. That being said, I'm honestly going to count each skin as like seven or eight bucks. Um, so I'll do the math later. He's got a chroma for Shockblade too. Sleigh Bell, Legacy. There's a lot of Legacy skins here that you can never get anymore. Star Ari. This is worth a lot, no? Cut Krakko. Mash Jaco. If it has Black Alistair, oh my god, that'd be insane. Maokai, Legacy, Galactic, Renekton. Maokai, Volley Bear. Definitely not, definitely not Blitzcrank. That's pretty cool. Okay, so let's see. Wow, this gets really intense later. So we got Surprise Party Amumu. We got Super Galaxy Fizz. We got Sugar Rush Ziggs. Star Guardian Lux. Spirit Fire Brand. Why is this, this is the, the guy who owned this? Just like going on a shopping spree or something? This happens. We got Snowman Yi, which is a legacy as well. We got Leg, wait, SKT T1 Jin is legacy? That's pretty rare. I didn't know that. Uh, Shadowfire Kindred, Santa Brom, Santa skins and all the Halloween skins are definitely rare. Santa Brom, Project Zed, caught a bunch of Project skins. That's awesome, actually. Full Party Zack, Mecha Kha'Zix. These are kind of old. Majestic Empress Morgana. What is this? The Light Enlightened Morgana from TFT. And then we got Little Devil Teemo. We got Knockout Lee Sin. Oh, and Teemo is a Halloween legacy skin, so you can't get it anymore. We got IG LeBlanc, High Noon Jin. Graveyard Azir, Forsaken Jace, Elderwood Hecarim, Demon Vi. I like this one. This one's cool. Cosmic Reaver Casting. This skin's cool. Uh, one of my favorite skins, Candy King Ivern. This can rise from a Candy Crush, honestly. I don't know why. Battle Boss Ziggs, Battle Academia Jace. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Surprise Party Party Phil Six. Star Guardian Jinx. Project Ash? Wait. 
These are the same. Project Ash is OP as hell. Sorry, you're doing Jinx. Oh, it's 1820 RP? Damn, they're like 20 bucks already. So basically, each of these champs are, or sorry, skins are like worth like 20 bucks. And these epics are worth, worth like 14, 13, 15 bucks. Okay. Yeah, or like, oh my god. Omega Squad Teemo. High Newton Lucian. Skin I love too. High Noon Ash. Damn, this guy loves buying skins. What can I say? And he's got Eternum Nocturne. But yeah, this guy's a fan of the High Noon. Dragon Tristana. Trainer Tristana. That was a cool skin. And finally, the Mythic skins, which is Annie. And then finally, you got Annie. Uh, it's not a legacy, but like, this was a cool skin because I don't know. I think her Tibbers does something cool. Um, it's really cool. And finally, obviously, the last one had Pulsefire Ezreal. And this one has Elemental as Lux, the ultimate skin. Honestly, this should have a new tier because it's like the best skin in the world. Uh, what other skin transforms besides Gun Goddess Misfortune, which was a letdown? So yeah, Elemental as Lux is the skin this guy gets. But this count is worth like... Man, hold on. Let me look it up. Show me the money. 800 bucks. 600, 600, 600. Let's go 600. <laughs> so I bought this account for 32 bucks. But, and the person who had this account spent 955 bucks on it. Now, obviously, you can't change the password and account. Like, it's super risky, and I, I don't even encourage it. And I think maybe you might get scammed later. Like, honestly, you'll probably get scammed later. And, like, somehow the account gets, like, taken or something. Like, I'll be honest, something like, like that feels like it would happen on eBay. So I don't recommend it. But obviously, I'm just seeing what happens. Um, and then uh, for Mo... Wow, this guy's got a lot of moats. Uh, this guy liked his account for sure. Man, look at all these emotes. And then icons. Is there ultimate uh, summon icons? I didn't know that. So for icons, these are the icons. I guess these are rare. We'll see what the purple ones are. The mythic icon is the anniversary border. So those are the ones. And these are epics. Now, obviously, I don't really care about icons. But if you guys do, I mean, it's interesting. And finally, the wards. What do you got for wards? Okay. World Rune Ward, Slaughter Left Ward, Sad Mummy, Pop Music Ward. Dude, I don't even have any of these on my account. What the hell? Dog Lover, Normal Ward, Santa Penguin, Penguin Ski Skier, Bat Glorious Legend Ward, and then the 10th Anniversary one. So, like, holy crap. And then some chromas you got here. Pink Blob, Majin Buu, Zack, my favorite. Dark Star Thresh. Yeah, this account's worth a lot. Jesus Christ. Fix you wonder. Why level up an account when I could just buy an account? I think you get Sam later, so I wouldn't risk it. That being said, you guys are probably wondering how much I have spent on my own League of Legends account. I've been playing for 10, you know, I've been playing for 11 years. You guys want to see how much I have spent? Watch this. I honestly think 200 bucks. Let's watch. <laughs> I don't know why it says this. What, what is this? Yeah, I've only spent 325 bucks on my main account. I've for 10 years. That's how much I've spent. I don't spend money on, on games. I am not a gacha gamer. I like to play League and grind. I don't know. I like to grind. You know what I'm saying? I don't care about the skins. I don't care about any of that. I just want to get the champs and whatever. So this number represents uh, basically 80 bucks for each year on like, let's say a single game because that's how pricey the games are these days. So I should be at 880, but League of Legends has given me entertainment for 325 bucks for 11 years. So, you know, I'm spending 30 bucks a year to have my League of Legends addiction entertainment because I love League of Legends so much, but also it's my job. But like, you know, 30 bucks a year, not bad, honestly. One week later. It's been a week or so. So I'm going to check to see what happened to this account. One second. Is it gone? Is it hacked? Is it anything? Find out. Has it been played on? Oh. It hasn't. It has not been played on. Hmm. Interesting. You just have the fear of someone basically logging on into it and then multiple people using it, so... Okay. Well, it works. And... Last played is still a month ago on february 3rd uh, still february 3rd and yeah i mean this is the count with the elemental lux definitely better than a pulse fire ezreal and a lot more skins so with that being said man this is i mean hey it still works but like i said you never know what might happen to these counts and you can't ever recover them that being said hope this is very interesting 
if uh, I mean if you guys ever wonder what these accounts were like I'll never use these accounts you know I have my main account that's the only thing I care about as well as my three smurfs or whatever how much smurfs I have thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time peace out